Hey guys, welcome back to my another video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use new AutoTune Pro. Actually, it's much more easier than previous version and it's gonna be very interesting for you. I'm gonna use it in FL Studio 20. You can use any kind of music editing software, it doesn't matter. Just purchase and install the plugins in your system. Watch my previous tutorial to know about how to make sound better in FL Studio. Okay, let's get started. Subscribe our channel and press the bell icon. Never miss an update from Tech Hunter. I have already recorded a vocal sample. Actually, I'm not a professional singer, but I tried my best to sing properly. Obviously, just for educational purpose only. Whatever. A lot of people asked me what kind of microphone I have used for recording. So recently, I'm using Boya M1 with 3.mm jack without any sound card, and that is how the microphone sounding. Let's have a listen before starting how it's sounding without auto tune. <laughs> Ridoi shagore elo bara kar dheu Bukhe ruto ne na che na za te re di Ti je shok rob chara bhuj bhe na keo Okay, first of all open mixer panel. I've already used some effects for make sound better. Now it's time to use auto tune. Okay, now just click on here to add a new effect. So you'll found auto key or auto tune pro after install auto tune in your computer. So at first add auto key which will help you to find out the skill key of your song. It's a new feature in auto tune pro and it makes auto tune much more easier. Okay after add auto key just play your full song once again and your song skill key will detect here. So I'm gonna play it. Sometimes it will show different different scale key, but don't worry, both will working. So here go for add another one auto tune pro and disable the auto tune before detect your key. So here first of all we have to make some custom settings as here select low male and if you are a female then select alto tuner and then select the scale key of your song if you know about it but if you don't know about it then go to your auto key and here as you can see it's detect the scale key of this song the scale key of this song is C minor there are two ways you can send it to auto tune here just click on send it to auto tune and you can select it manually and now enable the auto tune and start customization. So first we'll hear it once with full auto tune and that's for increase a little bit humanize and full the return speed. It will help us to find out the mistakes easily. We won't use auto tune in a huge amount cause it will make our sound robotic. Ok now just play your song in the background and start to customization. In this way you can set the auto tune properly. <laughs> Buke ruto ne na che na za te re di Ti je shok rob chara bhuj be na keo If you think that there are some mistakes in tuning then increase some flex tune it will make it proper. Now if you wanna decrease the amount of auto tune so increase some humanize and decrease return speed. In this way you can increase or decrease the amount of auto tune. So I think I should increase some flex tune once again. And you can use a little bit natural vibrator. Ok, I think that seems fine. Now let's have a listen how it's sounding with auto tune. Buke ruto ne na che na za te re di Ti je shok rob chara bhuj be na keo That's awesome. This one very useful for singing. I hope this video gonna be very helpful for you. If you wanna know more about autotune or FL Studio watch my previous tutorial link in the description. 
To get more this type of videos, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share. Thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe our channel and press the bell icon. Never miss an update from Tech Hunter.